So I'm just going to note this. That Logan took his gravy over here and put it on both. He spooned it on top of his chicken fried steak and then spooned it on top of his biscuits. Yep. Right? Me, on the other hand, I took half my biscuit. I took one biscuit, busted it in half, moved the little garnish inside, and just dumped a bunch of gravy on top of it. So it doesn't matter how you eat it. It just matters that you eat it. <laughs> I wanted to show you this. This is one of, it's a taco. It's a taco wing. I'm not sure. It's, it's a taco. Flavored taco chicken. Uh -huh. So let me try this. Actually, I'm not going to put any ranch on. I'm just going to try it. It's going to get straight taco flavor. Okay. Yeah. It tastes like a taco. Uh, it's good. It's good. I mean, the taste of taco seasonings in this. This is really yeah. good. Very different than what we've had before, but this is really good. Now I gotta try one. Yep. Yeah. Alright, gotta ask, how's the rib? Very good. Very good. This is some barbecue. As you can see, there's no sauce on there, but. Yeah. It's still really good. It looks really good. You know, whenever I'm used to having ribs, I'm used to having like barbecue sauce on them, so it's interesting in having it. No sauce, but still just as good. Yeah. I've had these ribs uh, before, and they're always good. Mm -hmm. And they're never, never like overly bathed in sauce. It's just mm -hmm. it's like, almost like they're cooked into, it's like it's cooked into the sauce, mm -hmm. the rib. It's, it's really yeah. good. Oh, it's great. Mm -hmm. You just tried to buy your Tim yeah, Allen look at, the, look, look at all this meat in here. Look at all that ham in there. I mean, I always knew that Tim Allen was a little hammy, but this is a lot of ham. It's really good. And the peppers make it really, really tangy. What kind of peppers I got in there? That's they're like pepperoncinis. These are like the banana peppers. Okay. These are the ones that are like not spicy. They're just real tangy. Mm -hmm. um, the ones that you can like, you can eat and not like, your mouth doesn't be set mm -hmm. on fire. If you want to know what we're talking about, go to our King's video. You see what we had, what they did there. This mm -hmm. is really good. Nice and meaty, very good bread. The sourdough. Uh, you can't go wrong with this one. Mm -hmm. So we just got our appetizer. The, the what is it, Logan? The fried pork chop pop. So that, I need to. You need to take the stick out. Take just the just stick want out. to split this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That looks pretty good, though. Oh yeah. One second here. One side a little. There we oh go. Oh my gosh, look at that. That looks delicious. It does. Oh my god. I think we made a good choice. Yeah. I asked about a jumbo cheeseburger, and they said it was like a quarter pound, and then they go, oh, we could do a double jumbo cheeseburger, so it's the freaking size of this thing. Wow. It looks amazing. It is amazing. It looks great. Mm -hmm. But probably not as good as your, your pastrami, pastrami sandwich. Look at all that meat. Jesus. Uh, it looks incredible. It does look incredible. Can't wait to, to get it. So let's get, let's get, a, let's get hungry. So I wanted to give you a closer look at this calzone. Look at all the chunks of mushrooms and olives and meat in here, sausage. This is delicious. I mean, it, it got, honestly, it does. It tastes like a combination pizza and stuffed inside this crust. I asked Logan, but he's got his mouth full of food. Good? Oh, yeah. And how's your hot dog? Uh, I bit into it, and it felt like the um, hot dog in a good way, like busted open. <laughs> <laughs> it looks, I like, like the, the the casing. Yeah, like, the casing yeah. is like boom. It's not like it's really juicy. <laughs> it's like, it a little bit paper. It's good though. Nice crunchy onions. You're not one for corn. You're not one for uh, sorry chili dogs either. You don't like because it. You don't like having like messy, messy food. Mm -hmm. And yet, you got, you got. I'd rather eat a uh, chili dog that's not like 
drenched in chili. Yeah, and that doesn't look like it's drenched. It looks like it has just enough because it looks, usually when you have a chili dog. I hope to God that was just a tree and not started raining in the middle of June. But usually when you have a, you know, a chili dog, usually it's just like, a chili that like usually goes all over the place. This one looks like it just stays right on the bun. Oh my right God, on the stop dog. moving. <laughs> uh. That is good. It's very good. <laughs> so our waiter just came by and dropped off some bread. Look at that bread. Rolls. Okay, they're all like, and they, <laughs> they're all like tack. It's a like tag of the bread. But they also dropped off a plate full of olive oil to dip our bread into. So this is pretty cool. Why don't you go ahead and try that? Okay. Good? Yeah, it's good. Good? This bread is really warm. <laughs> and it feels good in my hands. I don't know what's up with the with the red here. On the, kind of matches my shirt. Yeah. A little bit, but whatever it is, it is really good. I was asking, I was at, you know, someone was mentioning to me just kind of like the way they cook it here, but it is delicious. Let me just just show you. Look at that. That's tear it apart. Look at that. Nice. Oh my God, beautiful. Mmm. <laughs> So, so right, so we got Logan. I got the prime rib. That looks really good. Yep. Tyler, what did you try for? A lasagna. I think I had it last time I was here. And it's really That's good. That's a big serving of lasagna. It is. That is big. It's huge. It's a Garfield size. It's a Garfield size. <laughs> Don't worry, Miss Maddie. Maddie. I got a prime rib sandwich. A prime rib sandwich. Oh, you got the prime rib sandwich. Yeah. Okay. I got it last time I was here. Mm-hmm. Good. It's great. So the first impression of your burger? It's really good. It's like they got the like cheesemole things like this. It's really interesting. So it's oh, that's what the mac and cheese is. Mm -hmm. Nice. You were telling me, what were you telling me? What were you, first of all, your first impression? Um, it's really good. Like, at first I couldn't figure out where the mac and cheese was until it was in those weird hater tot things. Um, the, the chili tastes like something you would get at a baseball game. All right. But this is really good. It's like... You were telling me it has onion bits in it? Yeah. Yeah, this right on here. The bottom, These things. The bottom of it? Oh, nice. Nice and crunchy. Yeah. And then the onion rings are... The bomb. Really good. Really good. I gotta agree. These onion rings are really crispy. The what? pastrami sandwiches, they come with like little <laughs> banana peppers. These little peppers. I don't know if they're banana peppers. I don't know what, what they are, but last time we tried them. And I, I, yeah, I tried this. I boy, did this. that was a, that was a, this an experience. There's an experience. <laughs> let's, let, let's relive that experience right, right now. banana peppers <laughs> <laughs> and I'm gonna need some salt <laughs> <laughs> so I figured since you decided to torture yourself <laughs> I figured we'll make it easy we're gonna join the party yeah here goes So, fries. <laughs> that was not a good idea. <laughs> At all. Man brought me some uh, some brown sauce, but I'm warm my chicken. I'm gonna do that right now. Yeah. So one thing we've learned in the history of our channel is never turn down an offer from a cooker owner. Yep. Cause it's always going to be something good. Yeah, what are you saying? That G Smoke Texas barbecue—they offered us brisket or 
Yeah, sure. La Tapatio when they offered us their other sauce. Yeah, the other sauce. Never turned, turned down, down that kind of offer. Oh, that, that looks good. That looks good. They were over there like Madison's dipping french fries and giving them to her brother. I was saying that, wait, I, did, I went to hand him a fry and I was like, wait, no, I got a different fry. And imagine if I went to give it to him, dip it in a fry and just ate it instead. <laughs> it just was like, psych. <laughs> These are the crazy people I deal with when I have to eat. <laughs> How's your burger, by the way? I'm only on my like third bite because like, I break my jaw every time I try to bite it. You said that when you like bit into a glass and you your jaw. Yeah, popped. my jaw popped. Like I swear, I, I just broke my jaw trying to eat. It's big. Big. How is it? It's good so it's far. Wasn't that hard that time? <laughs> Just started eating some of the wings, and I think this is the chili lime. This is the regular. What you, the one you got? What you get? What do you think? I got one of those. It was really good. It's really good. It's really the only thing was it's like the bones were kind of slit. Yeah, mine so kind of broke too. Watch out for that. Mine kind of broke too. You just started yours, right? Yeah. Get a little bit of little flavor. I got a lot of. It. <laughs> I I made the mistake of dipping it in the bottom of it. The entire bite was just soft. <laughs> I think that's chili lime, right? You can, I can taste chili. The lime lime. You got the regular one, right? Yeah. Um, it, ha it has a bit of a kick, but it's really good. But it's just also not very overpowering. What do you mean not overpowering? I'm literally dying to overpowering. No, he, he got the regular. I didn't oh. dip it in sauce. <laughs> I just, I just got the wing and put it in my mouth and like, tasty. <laughs> yeah. I got a simple dipped cone that they put upside down in a cup because <laughs> I didn't want to like lose it or drop it or anything. And uh, I think that I'm not going to be able to pull this out of the cup. <laughs> Here. So I thought it was going to, okay. I, I, I thought it was going to be like a... <laughs> there you go. <laughs> All in the yeah, cup. Yeah, it's all in the <laughs> cup, baby. <laughs> I got the code. <laughs> Cause you had a bad day, you're taking one down. You sing a sad song just to turn it around. You still you don't know, you still you don't like. Something's a smile and you go for a ride. I had a bad day. <laughs> Break wrong. Break wrong. They told us just to go have a seat, and then also we walk over here. And this is the chili. Like, what, what, what would you say what it is, Logan? I'm here, family. I'm here, family. On a wall. There's Logger. There's Al. Look at this. Wow. Look at this. This is called a salty sailor. You can see Twix and I, I have no idea this over here what is this that's the cookie monster the cookie monster look at that cookie yeah, that's a giant cookie yeah that's why i got it that's why you got it yeah uh, covered in oreos oreos and oh my gosh i think we better start eating this before it melts away that's the slice of the pizza mm -hmm. this looks really good Mmm, it's a nice good thin crust to it. Mm -hmm. This is interesting. My first thought, I know I got cheese swimming down. <laughs> this is interesting. My first thought is you can really, really taste the barbecue sauce and the mm -hmm. pineapple, but you really get a good, there's a good chunks of bacon and chicken with this too. So the mixture you wouldn't think goes well together with the pineapple and the barbecue sauce, but it really does. And this is a nice thin crust. Something I'm not used to a whole lot. I don't usually get thin crust pizzas, mm -hmm. but this is really good. Oh, here comes our pizza. Oh my gosh. I've never had french fries <laughs> on a pizza before. But. Yeah. Here, let's move this out of the way. But yeah, that is crazy. That is crazy. French fries on top of a pizza. Oh, that looks delicious. If you so, guys like, you could put any empty trays over on the table behind you, okay. just for more space. Cool deal. Thank you. 
Fries on a pizza. French fries on a pizza. That's the, that must be the Molly's. Well, yeah, that's the Molly's fry pie. Uh, I thought it had bacon ranch and fries. I was like, I don't know whether to put ketchup on it or ranch. <laughs> or ranch. <laughs>